And the time has finally come. Wow. What a move from Alibaba. Down from my high of 9046 in less than two months. Like I said in my videos, it's very, very hard to invest in Alibaba. And I said it was going to go back into this range here of 70 and 75. And I said when this huge rally happened, I didn't make any money. I actually lost money throughout this year because it was just in that range. And then I had no more money. And that's when it rallied from a low of 69 all the way to 90. And now it's coming back down again. And I said there was a gap here at 72.69 and it finally got filled today all the gaps to the downside always always gets filled with alibaba i don't know <laughs> what's wrong with these chinese stocks no one wants it just imagine if we have just bought into any of the u.s tech stocks my goodness amazon made a new freaking high 199 look at the trend upwards look at alibaba downwards and every day you will have people say just buy alibaba because it's undervalued it has a low pe ratio it's oversold have you seen baidu lately my goodness i don't know what's going on with these chinese stocks nothing but straight down look how oversold it is does it matter? Are people coming to buy Alibaba, Baidu, Neo, JD? No, no, no. And you know, the market is still at all time highs. Imagine the market pulls back. Ooh, it's going to drag these Chinese stocks down. I am so stupid. I feel so stupid. I feel like such an idiot for believing in these Chinese stocks. The time that we should have got out was four years ago when they announced a tech crackdown. That's when we should have got out. And you know, back then they had these educational stocks that was all time highs and they also cracked that down. And what did it do? Ooh, it sold off and it sold off. And now there's no recovery for those educational stocks. And here we are with the e-commerce stocks, Alibaba, JD, PDD. Every single Chinese stocks is down. What's going on tomorrow? Every Friday for the last six weeks, these Chinese stocks have been red. They closed red. So... It's no brainer that it's going to either close red or be flat to kill options. I'm just venting right now because I've put so much energy into like watching these stocks and what did it do for me? Nothing. It made me become delusional <laughs> i lost so much money in these stocks that there's no way that i can possibly recover i'm just gonna work until i die and i will still be in debt that's how bad it is take a look at the news it's not good Shares of Chinese e-commerce companies are trading lower after Amazon announced that it will launch a new section on its website to help Chinese sellers ship fashion and lifestyle items to U.S. consumers. Guys, it doesn't matter how undervalued that you think these stocks are, these Chinese stocks. They're nothing compared to U.S. tech stocks. That's why U.S. tech stocks are at all-time highs. And Chinese stocks are at all-time lows. I'm exhausted. I don't know how I'm going to make my money back. I have no idea. I'm in so much debt. I don't know what I'm going to do. I can't even take out any more loans. Thank goodness. What's next, guys? Are we going to drop all the way to 70 and then 66? Yikes. See, even the gap here got filled. I jumped from here. Actually, there is... Oh, nope. See, it got filled. 
I'm telling you, every gap to the downside always gets filled. Let me know, guys. Do you really think that Alibaba can get to 80 or 90 this year? It doesn't seem that way.